Hi. In this video we'll be taking a look at how to legally change your name. Did you know that in the UK, the sound of wedding bells rings out more than 275,000 times a year? That's a whole lot of love, laughter, and yes, a fair share of dad dancing. But amidst all the festivities, have you ever pondered the nitty-gritty of changing your name after marriage? Well, no worries if you haven't, that's precisely what we're diving into today. Think of me as your guide, shedding light on the name change journey after both marriage and even divorce. So let's start with the big question, how do you actually change your name after tying the knot? First things first, you'll need to reach out to every organization that has your details on record. Banks, local councils, doctors, schools, utility companies, anyone holding your information needs to know about your name change. Contrary to what movies may suggest, it's not an overnight transformation. It's a bit of a do-it-yourself project. You'll have to send them a copy of your marriage certificate along with a letter explaining the change and requesting an update. While some may accept copies, others, like the passport office, might ask for the original certificate. Oh and don't forget your passport, if you're dreaming of a vacation under your new name, your passport needs to match. Now imagine the worry posting your marriage certificate to countless companies, hoping it doesn't get lost or damaged in transit. But guess what? There's a smoother alternative, the deed poll. These nifty documents offer an easier way to change your name. No need to worry about your precious marriage certificate getting lost in the shuffle. Now onto the exciting part, name change options. Tradition dictates taking your partner's surname, but remember the choices are yours to make. Whether you keep your surname, take on your partner's, double barrel it, or get creative, it's your call. A deed poll might be your new best friend. Using a deed poll is a breeze. All you have to do is sign it in front of witnesses, and you're good to go. Now what about post-divorce name changes? It's a similar journey to post-marriage. You'll need to inform companies about your new name. You've got two options here. You could send off official documents, including your decree absolute and evidence of your name before marriage. Or you could simplify the process with a deed poll. It's quicker, easier, and much safer than mailing those precious documents. Get in touch with Vital today and we can issue your deed poll. 